Hi guys, it's your curious and awkward friend Vasi. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited to see you here. And if you have seen literally any of my other videos, you might know that I usually like taking you around with me in London or in other cities, tell you their stories. But on today's video, I actually want to tell you my own life story. Oh. And I will tell you how did I actually change my life during lockdown. I really hope that I can inspire you to follow your dreams and show you that there is never really a bad time for you to change your life. I honestly never never thought that I would be sharing these things even with my friends and now I'm sharing it with you guys so watch this video before I actually decide to delete it. A huge thank you to the sponsor of our today's video which is Refractly. Their services actually really helped me get to the happy an excited person that I am today. Let me actually give you a little bit of a pre-story on my life because I feel like I never actually introduced myself to you. My name is Vasi, I'm 24 years old and I'm from Sofia, Bulgaria. I went to high school in Sofia and after that I went to uni in Milan and I studied fashion marketing and communications and honestly studying and living in Milan was the best time of my life. I was also doing long distance with Ben because we met during my first year of studies and we were doing long distance for more than three years I would say and after I graduated I thought it's finally time for us to start living together or at least in the same city and this is when I moved to London in 2018 and I also started working and I would say that after a couple of months working nine to five a regular job I kind of started realizing that it's not as good as it looks like and I always kind of knew that I have also other skills and I could be just doing way more than what I'm actually doing on my daily job. So I started getting more and more unsatisfied with my life and uh, being very unhappy also with London, even though it has nothing to do with the city. I would say I just continued living my regular nine to five life and being very unsatisfied and unhappy in winter and kind of okay in summer when I was traveling more and as this seems kind of the norm this is what I continue doing and everything was going as usual until 2020 happened and you all know that borders started closing down shops started closing and restaurants and many sectors of the economy were affected very bad time for the fashion industry where I'm working so in April this year I was put into furlough and for those of you that don't know what the furlough scheme in the UK is I was getting paid 80% of my salary and I was not required to work until basically they call you back which never actually happened in my case no matter how bad the pandemic was for many families and guys I'm honestly really sorry if some of you were affected and lost uh, their families for me on a personal level during this furlough time it was one of the best periods for me had the time to think hmm, what would I do if I didn't have a regular job and also had some kind of backup of money so I knew that I could actually pay my rent and this is when my YouTube channel happened and guys please let me know in the comments down below how your life has changed in 2020 everything was going great the furlough scheme was sponsoring my traveling videos and this is also why guys I was able to take you with me to Greece or to Italy and you seem to love this content and I also love making it for you but unfortunately in September I was made redundant and lost my job. We're done. What? You're fired! <laughs> so I had to come back to London and start looking for a new one. And if you like videos like this, make sure you subscribe and like. And I kind of started feeling like 
this is the moment when karma hit me and I was back in London and I started reading so many negative articles like one in three people working in a creative industry lost their job or that more than 750,000 people lost their job we as young people are twice as likely to lose their jobs you this is also the time when I was finding it extremely hard to continue with my videos and be like super smiley and positive and keep creating content for you but there was one thing which actually really helped me going and it is Refractly which is also the sponsor of today's video Refractly is the number one journaling app out there which is kind of like your best friend as well because the more it gets to know you more personalized questions it makes and uh, it also shows you this amazing graphs and it's super design oriented and this is me in the morning super happy filling in this mood diary and the way in which the app works is that you can write down like in traditional diary how did your day go and you can also add lots of photos and make it super cool and visual but uh, you can also track your mood it's gonna ask you every single day how did your day go and it will also give you personal motivational quotes in the morning and also during the day I will link Reflectly in the description down below and also in the comments and you can go and check it out yourself and try the seven day free trial one of the things which the app made me realize is that the things that make me happy are food traveling my relationship and work as you may know if you have seen one of my latest videos i actually found again a job in the fashion industry and i'm super happy for this but at the moment i have an extremely tight schedule and what i mean is that i do yoga every day for at least 40 minutes i do my regular job nine to five well actually i wish it was nine to five it's more like nine to six i make content for you guys which usually takes me like 10 hours a week i would say and i'm also learning the version if you're wondering how do I actually have time to do all those things well my secret is having a plan for every single day and as you can imagine I'm millennial I'm lazy and I don't write writing things down I'm using the app code time block it really helps me first of all kind of create my own routine design here it's so cute that I honestly get super satisfied of watching the schedule for every single day it's actually integrated with my calendar and it sends me reminders because yeah to be honest with you sometimes I tend to forget those things hi uh, for this video I'm in charge of making the conclusion but she's really improved a lot you know in the last year uh, I remember when like when she, she moved to London she was she used to say oh, the city doesn't want me but now I can really see that especially thanks to YouTube you know she's really found a way to like enjoy staying here and you know moving forward with her career I think like things really get better if you want to see more travel related content whenever we can travel again or videos from London don't forget to subscribe it really really means the world to me and thank you again Reflectly for sponsoring this video love you loads bye